in this video let me consider one example to find equivalent resistance between the terminals determine the equivalent resistance between terminals a and b for the circuit shown below this is the given circuit we supposed to find the equivalent resistance between terminal a and b so this is the given circuit here we can see that we have 3r and this 3r this 3r are connected in delta fashion i will try to convert this into star fashion so the equivalent star values will appear here like this one register will appear here like this another register will appear here and another register will appear here let me call. so let me assume the value of this register is x value of this register is y and value of this register is z so x can be found calculated as x is equal to the product of these two that is 3r into 3r divided by sum of these three registers that is 3r plus 3r plus 3r 3r plus 3r plus we have 3r which is equal to so this is nothing but 9r into r divided by we have 9r so 9r 9r will get cancelled the value of x will be equal to r so similarly y is also equal to 3r into 3r divided by same thing and z is nothing but 3r into 3r divided by same thing so value of x y z are same that is nothing but r so similarly here also the structure is same that is 3r 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 connected in delta fashion we will try to convert that also into star fashion the equivalent star will appear like this so here also the value of these registers are nothing but r this is also r this is also r let me draw the equivalent circuit by removing these delta fashion registers we have terminal a here this is a so let me draw this r this is r and here we have x y z this is x and we have this is y and this is z so value of x y z is r r and r and here we have one more r this is r so now this point to this point there is 3r this is 3r and here from this point to this point here also we have 3r this is point b this is 3r so now similarly here we have r that is this r i am drawing and here we have r r r that is one r is here one r is here one r is here and another r is here this is r this is r this is r and again we have r here that is this is r which is connected to this point so now from this circuit we can observe that this r and this r are in series this r this r is in series these two are in series and these two are in series let me reduce the circuit so this is point a terminal a we have this r and r are in series let me draw it as 2r so this is 2r Similarly, here we have one more R. So here we have R. Similarly, from this point again, these two is another R. Here we have two R. Then in between this is three R. Here we have R. It should be connected here. That is done already. Then here we have three R. Here we have three R. So this is three R, and here also we have three R. This is point B. This is three R. This is three R. Similarly, here these two R. That is two R. This is two R. 
so this is r which is this one now these two are nothing but 2r so from this point we have 2r this is 2r so this is the reduced circuit now let's try to simplify further so now in this circuit we can see that 2r 3r and r these three are in delta fashion so i can convert this into equivalent star so the star circuit will appear like this one terminal will be here and here we have this is the equivalent star circuit similarly here also we can see that r 3r and 2r are in delta fashion i will try to convert this into star so here it looks like this so it will be like this let me call the value of this is say x say this is y and say this is z z so here also it is same x is nothing but this this is also x so in between r and 2r is z so in between r and 2r this is z and here we have y between 2r and 3r 2r and 3r that this is y so here let me find x x will be equal to r into 3r that is r into 3r divided by sum of these three that is r plus 2r plus 3r which gives we have 3r into r divided by 3 plus 2 plus 1 that is 6r here r r will get cancelled 3 by 6 is 1 by 2 that is nothing but r by 2 so value of x is r by 2 similarly so here also 3 by 2 and this is also this x is nothing but r by 2 this x is nothing but r by 2 similarly let me calculate y so y will be equal to 2r into 3r into 3r divided by 6r so it gives r so this is nothing but 6r into r divided by 6r which is nothing but r so value of y is r similarly z is equal to we have 2r into r that is 2r into r divided by 6r this rr will get cancelled it gives r by 3 r by 3 now let me draw the equivalent circuit so here this terminal is a so here we have one register y it is connected here like this and there is one more register at this point and from here we have x value so value of this is y that is r value of this is z which is nothing but r by 3 value of x is r by 2 this is r by 2 and here this 2r is connected as it is this is 2r which is connected to point b similarly here we have x is nothing but r by 2 so this is r by 2 here we have z so z value is r by 3 and here we have y which is nothing but r so this is connected to same point that is it is connected to both are connected to same point that is b and here we have 2r which is connected between this and this so here we have 2r this is 2r so from this circuit we can observe that this r by 3 2 r are in series these two registers are in series these two registers are in series let me simplify further so that is this can be written as so this is a here we have r from this point we have r so here r by 3 plus 2 r are in series so r by 3 plus 2 r it gives 7 by 3 r so the equivalent value is 7 by 3 r which is connected to point b and here r by 2 plus r by 2 is r so from this point we have r that is sum of these two is r and here again we have one more r this r is connected to this point 
and here 2r plus r by 3 which is again 7 by 3r so it is connected between these two points that is 7 by 3r so this is the reducer network here we can see that this r r 7 by 3 are in delta fashion similarly here also these three registers are in delta fashion convert either this delta into star or this in delta into star so this is the same circuit now i will convert these three registers into star the equivalent star network may looks looks like this so they say this is x y and this is z so here value of x will be equal to r into 7 by 3 r it is r into 7 by 3 r divided by we have r plus 7 by 3 r plus r that is r plus 7 by 3 r plus r so simplifying this we will get so here this is nothing but 7 by 3 r into r divided by r plus 7 by 3 r plus r it gives 13 by 3 r 13 by 3 r that is nothing but r r will get cancelled this 3 and 3 will get cancelled we will get 7 by 13 r that is 7 by 13 r so similarly y value is equal to this into this divided by sum of these three that is r into r divided by 13 by 3 r which is nothing but r r will get cancelled we will get 3 r by 13 3 r by 13 similarly z will be equal to r into 7 by 3 r that is r into 7 by 3 r which is same as 7 by 13 r 7 by 13 r so let me simplify further so this is a so here we have x value here we have y value here we have z value x value is 7 by 13 r and y value is 3 r by 13 and z value is 7 by 13 r then we have again here 7 by 3 r and here we have r these two point is connected to b now these two are in series and these two are in series so here we have 7 by 13 r so 7 by 13 is nothing but 0 0.5384 r and here we have 3 r by 13 plus 7 by 3 r which, which are in series these two combinations are in series that is we have 3 r by 13 plus 7 by 3 r so it gives 2.564 r so value of this will be 2.564 r so similarly here 7 by 3 and here we have 1 r both are in series that is 7 by 13 r plus r so it gives 1.538 r so value of this is 1.538 8 r these two terminals are connected to b this is a so now further this can be simplified as so here this register and this registers are in parallel so it will be so this is the value of 0 0.538 r this is terminal a these two are in parallel so that is 2.564 r into 1.538 r divided by we have 2.564 r plus 1.538 r so simplifying this it gives it gives 0 0.9613 so that is in series with this this is b point that is 0 0.9613 so now here we can observe that these two values are in series so 0 0.9613 should be added with this is r so it should be added with this that is 0.538 so it gives one point four nine nine 
R between A B. So this is nothing but we have three by two R. That is nothing but one point five. So this is the equivalent resistance between terminal A and B. Thank you for watching.